delivering parts to the line at BMW Manufacturing's new assembly hall in upstate South Carolina is now cleaner and greener. BMW will use hydrogen fuel cells to power more than 85 forklifts, pallet trucks, and other material handling equipment, making it one of the largest fuel cell fleets in the United States. Using this green technology is consistent with one of the core principles of the BMW Group, sustainability. One of the important things for us when we started this project was that it be a good example of the sustainability aspect of BMW as a company. Uh, this project is a very sustainable project. Hydrogen is the fuel of the future, as they call it. And this project is intended to use only hydrogen for as long as this building is going to be operating as the means of powering the material handling equipment. Simply put, a fuel cell is an electrochemical energy conversion device. The fuel cell takes stored chemical energy, like hydrogen, and converts it into electrical energy through two internal electrochemical reactions. The only byproducts are heat and water. At BMW, the liquid hydrogen is transported to the plant's energy center where it is stored in a 15,000 gallon tank at minus 400 degrees Fahrenheit. The hydrogen is vaporized, which turns the liquid into gas and then compressed and stored in four high pressure cylinders. From there, the hydrogen gas is sent to BMW's new assembly hall. Inside the facility are six hydrogen fueling stations and more than 85 fuel cell units supplied by project partner Plug Power. One of the main advantages of this project to add to the sustainability aspect is that it uses essentially very, very little electricity. A battery requires electricity as a source of power. Uh, you have to charge the battery with electricity. The hydrogen is the only source of energy for the, the fuel cells and it actually avoids, this project actually avoids 1.8 million kilowatt hours per year of, a, of electricity consumption to charge batteries. And 1.8 million kilowatt hours essentially, uh, if you don't buy that electricity, you avoid uh, about 1,200 tons per year of CO2 emissions. Using hydrogen instead of lead acid batteries has several advantages. Fuel cells provide continuous power at all times with no loss of power until the tank is completely empty. Battery powered equipment has less power available as the battery nears empty. Fuel cell units can be refueled by a driver in less than three minutes at a hydrogen fueling station on site. On average, it takes 20 minutes to change out a depleted battery. Another advantage in my mind is the disposal characteristics of a battery, a lead acid battery, is that you've got lead and you have acid. Um, and, and the life of the battery is only about three years, whereas the life of a fuel cell is at least six. So they last twice as long and you don't have the disposal issues that you do with the lead acid battery. The hydrogen fuel cell project is the perfect complement to BMW's successful landfill gas to energy program started in 2003. BMW manufacturing powers about 50% of the plant's total energy needs using methane waste gas from a local landfill. Now, with this green hydrogen fuel cell technology, BMW continues its commitment of being the most sustainable company in the automotive industry.